Alright, we are back with more post-game in Pokemon Sword. So let's go over here. Return the Rusted Sword. Yes. So that means as a mentor, thanks loads for helping us out. It took us a little while, but we brought back your precious relics and all. <clears throat> you know how to turn the Rusted Sword into the Rusted Shield. Alright, that settles it. Mark, why don't you and I head back? What are you going to do, Sonya? I think I'll stay here a bit longer. I want to do a little more research here in the forest. My power spot's tech is going off. Well, well, well. I thought I heard someone making some noise over this way. Ah, uh, we've got some more baddies to deal with, it looks like. You wouldn't be the Professor Sonya who wrote the book Galar History. Uh, you bought my book? Yes, of course. Read it from cover to cover. Well, yes, of course. I wrote an internet review for it. That awful book was filled with lies, so we gave it one star. What? There are no lies printed in that book. That's just plain rude. I am Swordward. I am Shieldbird. We are the new kings of Galar. We're descendants of the first kings. More than that, we're celebrities. New kings? Descendants? Seriously, what are you on about? What exactly are you supposed to be? Well, well, well. Could these things here be the fabled sword and shield? Well, 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 they certainly are dirty. They must be fake. I fear to touch them with my bare hands. And Swordward takes the rusted sword. Shieldbird takes the rusted shield. Don't go nicking those. We just returned them. Oh, dude, shut up. We only have to pick up some things that were dropped on the ground. How do you prove to whom they belong? There's no way we can prove who those ancient things belong to. Even if we can't prove it, it really poor the Zacchaeans as a menta. Oh, he's not wrong. Oh, goodness. Such a plebeian, and yet so pushy. If it's really so important to you, perhaps we should settle this one a battle. We're celebrities who buy battles for twice what they're worth. What does that even mean? I, and if it's sword word in your poem. If you're playing the post scheme for shield, you battle Shieldbird. But here we're batting Swordward. And he's going to start off with Surfetch. And I don't think I healed. No, I did not. And Leaf Blade is going to kill Barkley because I didn't heal. Alright, let's go with uh, Eldegoss. Meteor Assault. Oh, that almost wiped out Eldegoss. Uh, let's go with a Razor Leaf. And Kermit levels up. He's at level 64 now. I'm going to use a regular revive on Pikachu here. It's going for X Scissor on Eldegoss, which is going to kill it. Alright, Pikachu, come on out here, buddy. Emergency exit. Oh, yeah, that's its ability. So now it's going for buy sharp. Let's try Thunderbolt. Alright, well, we paralyzed it anyway. Steel wing.
Brave Bird. And Sword Stance. Alright, perfect. One more Steel Wing. Dew Blade. Wait, I know I still have max revives left, but I would rather save those for some really important battles here. Alright, let's bring Pikachu back. And Sacred Sword is going to kill Dartwing. And let's get Barkley back out here. Flamethrower. And that's going to kill Dewblade. Level 60 for Snorlax. And Pikachu, you can come back out here. Thunder Punch. What? Oh, okay. We didn't even get to attack it. Uh, alright. I guess uh, we'll have to bring Snorlax out then. Let's go Crunch. Alright, it's going with liquidation. Heavy slam. And finally, ice punch. Let's gonna go for the X scissor and wipe out Snorlax. Are you kidding me? All right. Well, even though it's a tight disadvantage, I am gonna have to bring Barkley out. Oh, but Extreme Speed though does take priority, so that should kill his Golisopod, and it does. Level 62 for Barkley. Forget about your Pokemon, what about mine? I gotta heal pretty much everybody. Something in your mind, boy? You weren't concentrating at all during our battle. Older brother, isn't that the one who stopped Eternatus? Oh, now that I look closely, I believe it is. What a rude child, snatching up our chance at glory like that. According to our sources, I believe he was also present during the destruction of the magnificent mural our ancestors so artfully created many years ago. What a garish brute, destroying the mural our family has held such high esteem for so long. Mural? 
I mean, the one that hit the historical ruins of Zakin and the others? And hold on a moment. Mark was the one that destroyed it. Exactly. Let us withdraw for now. Next time we shall bring Pokemon that will utterly defeat. That's right. And with that, farewell. Wait! Stop! Get back that rusted shield! Oh. Alright, she's going back to the lab. And we are going to the Pokemon Center to heal. That way I don't have to use up my revives. Unless everyone's automatically sealed. No, they're not. Alright. Alright, we have to go to the Pokemon Center then. So let's go up here first, before we do anything, otherwise we're going to be at a serious disadvantage. There we go! Alright, let's see what the Lotto ID has for us today. The last digit. And we got a bottle of Moo Moo Milk. Okay. Now we go in here. Hmm. Professor Sonia, you have a visitor. Who's this? She's my assistant. I've been so busy with research lately, I've had to bring on some extra help. I've been keeping all the wishing stars that Chairman Rose have been gathering here in the lab. Things have been a little hectic around here, but my assistant's been handling things in a proper fashion. He's really been helping me keep things afloat. I really haven't been doing all that much. You're Mark the Champion, right? I'm really glad I get to meet you. It's an honor, truly. Come here for a moment, would you? There's something I want you to have a look at. Alright, what's that? You remember my power spot detector, right? It detects places where Dynamaxing is possible. Basically, when there's a high concentration of Galar particles, the readings spike. And that's how I figured it out. The power spot detector reacted when those two got close. So what does that mean? Basically, follow the readings from the power spot detector, you might be able to find those sword and shield weirdos. Sword, word, and shield might claim to be royalty with their weird fancy names, but it's easier to just call them weirdos, don't you think? Let's get back on topic, though. I placed Power Spot Detectors all around Galar, and now it's their time to shine. Power Spot Detectors, access! We are at the lab. That's a way bigger reaction than what I thought. Looks like it's coming from Turfield Stadium? <clears throat> you always Dynamax Pokemon at the stadium, so that's not exactly unusual. But these readings are way higher than normal. It can't be Eternatus. You already caught it. Maybe it's something related to those sword and shield weirdos. You should go check it out, Mart. Since you are a snazzy new champion and all, I've set up your town map to show where the strong particle reactions are coming from. So have a look at it. So turf field's where we have to go first, but we are not going to do that quite yet. What we're going to do in the next episode is we're going to go back to the wild area for some post-game raids. See you there.